Ladies and gentlemen, let's broaden our minds. So Hulu just dropped the official trailer for their Hellraiser film that's going to be debuting and coming out on their streaming service October 7th. And let me tell you, this trailer looks very interesting and it's definitely got my attention. Me being a fan of the Hellraiser franchise and has been upset with it because they try to do all these remakes and reboots and versions of it that, <clears throat> excuse me, that was just whack. I didn't like it. And looking at this trailer, I'm saying to myself, finally, they're going to do right by the franchise and bring us a better version, something that's totally different. Now, with Hulu, now, I'm definitely rooting for Hulu because, one, they did the prequel to the Predator film, which was a really good film called Prey. So if you guys haven't seen Prey, you need to check that out because they did right by the Predator franchise with that film. And God knows we haven't had a good Predator film in I don't know how long. And looking at the trailer for this, it looks like Hulu is going to be two for two in the uh, horror film department. Now, let me give you the premise of what the story is going to be about. It says a young woman struggling with addiction comes into possession of an ancient puzzle box Unaware that the purpose is to summon the Cenobite, a group of sadistic supernatural beings from another dimension. So just looking at the trailer and then looking at what the film is going to be about, as I said, it's definitely got my attention to want to check this out. And I'm glad that Hulu decided to pick this up and say, hey, let's do right by the fans. Let's do right by this franchise because this is a franchise that people love that just haven't been um, <clears throat> getting this just due. Now, one of the things that caught my uh, attention with the trailer is that we all know that Pinhead has always been a guy. But in this film, Pinhead is going to be a woman played by Jamie Clayton. That right there, I was like, okay, that's different. And then also looking at the trailer too, it seems like it's going to be um, more intense, more edge of your seat, more, um, um, how can, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, yeah, it'll come to me, but those two things, edge of the seat, attention, and uh, just keeping you wanted to know what else is going to happen. So before you guys check out the new Hellraiser, I strongly recommend that you check out the first two Hellraisers, not those other ones, the first two, because those are classics that you need to see before you see this one. And also what makes these, uh, the first two films, it makes the Hellraiser, I'm sorry, the Hellraiser film franchise interesting because it's done by Clive Barker, one of my favorite uh, writers in the horror film. And if you guys don't know who Clive Barker is, he's the gentleman that also brought us Candyman. He wrote and created Candyman. So if you like the original Candyman, you like the original Hellraiser, then you definitely need to check this out. So on my temperature scale for the trailer of low, medium, high, I'm going to give the Hellraiser trailer a high. And if you guys haven't seen the trailer, check out the trailer. Let me know your thoughts about it. Also, when you check out the movie on October 7th, come back and leave, me, leave your comments below. Let me know what you think about it. And until then, holla at your boy.